Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Please subscribe, like, and comment down below. Press the red button right down below to subscribe to this channel. So today I'm going to do a makeup look for you guys. A simple, basic makeup look. On my next video, I'm going to do a holiday glam look just because the holiday season's coming. So I'm just doing a basic look right now. I'm not sure what colors I'm going to use. I'm just going to play with the colors that I have. So if you want to see me get a nice makeup look, then keep watching this video. I'm going to use an angled brush and I'm using the Dip Brow Ebony and Anastasia. I already dipped a little in and I'm going to shape my brows. guys that's em in the background because she's doing homework supposedly doing homework and zachary my son is sitting in a chair watching tv so if you hear any type of like noise or anything like that that's what's going on in my background i'm just trying to get this video in real quick because you know how it is when you have kids and stuff like that today i'm home so i'm just trying to get in this video while I have the time to do it, if you know what I mean. So, my brow. I'm just shaping my brow. So, I don't have that many eyebrows. As you can see, any that many eyebrow hairs. So, my brows are pretty basic when I have to, like, do them. Because I don't have brows, period. If you saw when I just started the video, I have no brows whatsoever. So, it's kind of easy for me to do my brows so that's my brows so then I'm going to prime my face and I'm gonna be using MAC prep what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a little bit of my concealer which is ColourPop no filter concealer dark 46 and it looks like this and I'm gonna take a tad bit of this and put it on my lid and this is to help with any eyeshadow application that I'm going to do so that it stays on my lid because you need some type of base. Sometimes I use that as my base or sometimes I will use um, this as my base which is the Anastasia um, eye primer that I got a little travel size one. This is the one that I use sometimes. So now my brows and my base is set in. So I'm just dusting this off. And for eyeshadow, I'm gonna be using my Mario Pastor, my Mario palette by my Master Palette by Mario. I can't even talk. My Master Palette by Mario, and this is what it looks like. And it has pretty neutral colors. I like this palette because I use it most often because the colors are pretty neutral. So um I'm putting in my base color and for the colors that I'm using for my base will be Isabel and Vi Viola Violetta and Isabel is like a light brown and Violetta is like kind of like a darker brown so I'm just putting this in to my crease like this and just using little windshield wiper technique to blend everything in I'm gonna put a little bit more on this eye and just blend it in like so and then I'm gonna do the other eye and I'm just blending at this point I'm just blending my shadows in so that it has a clean slate so when I put my actual color it doesn't look um it doesn't look kind of blotchy and not blended well if you know what I mean if you see some people's eyeshadow sometimes it doesn't look great because it's not blended and you can see a ton of harsh lines and I don't want that to happen with my eyeshadow so I'm just blending 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 like that I'm just blending it in and as you see that's my crease and like I said this is a basic eyeshadow palette so it's going to be pretty basic with everything that I'm going to do so I'm going to take my Sigma eye shading brush E55 and this is what it looks like and it's a little shader and you see how her eyelash 
Emma's putting her, her to some her screen Her eyelash off. that she just did, it's turning like a, a, like a pinkish brown. And then I'm going to use Marina and Paris onto my lid. Just like that. I'm just going to dab it on like that. I usually do my eyeshadow first before my foundation because a lot of times the foundation has fallout and you don't want to have that all over your face while you're putting foundation on. So this is what's happening. Yep, it looks like a pretty glitter brown. So I'm just dabbing this on. And guys, if you see that, there's an elf in our shelf in our house She's right so now. excited about the elf in the shelf, guys, that we have. Because I just came back today from my grandma's house. Yeah, she just came back from her grandma's. And the elf on the shelf was here. Our so elf on the shelf arrived on Friday. It arrived on so, Friday. I'm just putting... And guys, if we're able to, we could probably vlog when we open our Christmas presents on Christmas. Yeah, she wants to vlog it for you guys. So I'm just blending, blending, putting my color... So my color is on, so I'm going to take the same blending brush again, and I'm going to blend out to make sure all the lines are pretty much blended in, like so. So I'm just blending and blending and blending. So now I'm going to put my wing liner, and I'm using Man Eater from Tarte. I love this eyeliner. My sister-in-law got it for me for last Christmas and I've been using it ever since then. And I didn't think that it would last as long as it has. But it's been lasting me a very long time. So I'm just winging out my wing. Even sometimes guys, wings are hard for me to do sometimes. I'm still like screwing it up every now and then because sometimes you put too much or they're not even. And guys, we're going to try to vlog on my birthday, which is January 7th. And I'm going to David Buster's for my birthday and I'm inviting my friends and family. So that's pretty much my wing right now. It's as clean as it gets. So now I'm going to, I already primed my face, so now I'm gonna put my foundation, which for foundation, I'm using the Revolution Makeup Foundation, and it's full coverage foundation, conceal and define, and it looks like this, and I've been loving this foundation. The color is F13, and it wasn't even very expensive. I rotate between this and my Makeup Forever, and my Kat Von D, and I have a couple other foundations, but I always tend to come back to using this one. So yeah. I'm just putting my foundation all over my face. And it's so big! Yeah, the tube is very, very big, so it lasts a very long time. So I'm just putting everything in. Yep, it looks like her face is changing color a little bit. Put it all over my face, and that's enough foundation. And then I usually take my dome brush, my dome brush. I use, use this one or a different flatter one. And this is the Sigma F86. And this is what it looks like. And I mix in the colors that she just put on her face. So I'm just mixing everything in. Mixing, mixing Like so. Mixing. Sometimes I use this brush or I'll use my beauty blender, but my beauty blenders need to be cleaned. So I'm not going to use that on my face because we know how important it is to make sure that you um, clean your makeup brushes so that your face doesn't start to break out and you don't get rashes and stuff like that. So I'm just blending everything out. Blending, blending, blending. Everything out. Nice and wellly blended. So my foundation looks good very very good 
So I, I usually blend down to my chin sometimes so that there's no change of color between my neck and my face. So now that I blended that in, now I'm going to put the same concealer, the ColourPop one, that I used to prime my for my eyeshadow. I'm going to put that underneath. Yep. That's all you need. You don't need so much because this comes a very long way. And then I'm going to blend this out. And if you're scared to put it under your eye like that, just close one eye while you're doing it and then close the other eye. So that's blended under my eye. And then now I'm going to take my Airspun Loose Face Powder and it looks like this. And you can pick this up at Walmart. I really enjoy using this powder and it lasts a very, very long time. Yep, a very, very long time. So I just dip some in and like dust it off a little. And then I apply it all over my face, wherever I put powder, wherever I put any type of powder foundation any type of foundation or concealer i just take a little bit of it and just blend it out so that my skin is like set the right way so i'm blending it in once it's blended in i'm done doing that so then i'm gonna take my um bronzer which is park avenue princess from tarte and then I'm going to take the shade Crown, which is like the end shade. I'm going to take this last shade over here, Crown. And I just blend it in like so on the cheeks. That's my son. He wants to get out of his chair. So blend that in. So my face is like chiseled and it has dimension and then I just do a little on my forehead and then I'm done with that and then I like to use my blush which is Anastasia Blush Trio. I love this palette and I use the shade Velvet very often, the last shade because I like it that much. I use it all the time, like all the time. So for seven. I'm going to take my Kat Von D shade and light brush and, as and you I'm see, dipping it in. it's double sided and or light and I put a blush here. Yep. On my cheeks. And, and guys, that's good. thank you for um, putting views on our other video because we have 127 views already. Oh yeah, we do. Thank you guys. Keep on watching. And then I'm going to put my highlight like this and, keep and this is my this is my Nicole Guerrero Anastasia palette my eyeshadow or highlighter palette and if you haven't seen I have a review on that I use that all the time as well so my lipstick is on and then I'm gonna take my highlighting palette again and I'm gonna take my brush right here a round dome brush and I'm going to take the color Forever Young and I'm going to dip it in a little and I'm going to apply that to my brow bone. Yep, brow bone. I so I have a little thing. bit of dimension here. So I'm putting that and then I'm going to put a little in my inner duck. And guys, if you have an elf on the show, comment down below if it's a girl or a boy. Emma uh, wants you to comment down below if you have an elf on the shelf and if it's a boy or a girl because she wants to know she has a girl. So everything is done and now I'm going to use Anastasia Dewy Set and I'm going to prime my face. And this is going to keep it so that my makeup stays like for a very long time. So And this is going to dry out on my face. And it's gonna look fine and it's gonna look not wet anymore and then I'm gonna put bad gal bang from benefit on my lashes as a mascara yeah. sometimes I put on lashes and sometimes not so for this look I'm not gonna put lashes because this is a basic look and you don't really need lashes for this look and it mess up your cuteness sometimes so this is my makeup look 
Thank you guys for watching. Please Sub subscribe to our channel Get down below. Big press big the big red big button. Big like, big comment, big and, big and subscribe. Big and this is Emma into my video again. So we'll see you guys in the next video. And bye. bye.